when you are selling your products on amazon it's super super important to check your competition study your competition check out like how many sales they are getting and from where they are getting the sales so you can also learn from them you can also copy the same strategies and implement on your listing to get more and more sales and more and more revenue right so in today's video i have bring you a free chrome extension that can actually help you to save a lot of your time while studying your competition and all of the thing which you are currently doing manually by opening your competitor listing one by one and checking out their data so basically after using this chrome extension you will not have to check out all of those things one by one from their listing and you can actually get all the data about your competitor on the front page of amazon easily and that can actually save a lot of your time like maybe after watching this video you will be able to do the work of 2 or 3 hours into just 10 to 15 minutes right so this video is super super important for you if you want to save a lot of your time and make your research more productive so you can actually make your decision fast implement the strategies fast and make a lot of money from your amazon product even more faster than before so if you are also excited to learn about this free chrome extension then keep on watching this short video completely till the end step by step without skipping any part so as you can see that this is my one week sales and if I put the filter for past one year and click on apply so you can see that this is my one year sales. You can see that throughout the year I got consistent sales and my sales actually increased in December which was Christmas season. So around 150k was the revenue and a cool thing about this is that the PPC spend was very less for the lifetime. So basically I don't do any magic, I only use common sense and use some tips and tricks which I have already explained to you in these videos. So if you also want to learn all of those tips, tricks and strategies, you can just go on my Amazon playlist on YouTube and learn all the tips for free just to get the revenue like this. Alright guys, so as you can see here, I'm on my laptop right now and from here I have opened Amazon website. So let's just search for any product on Amazon website and see what this Chrome extension actually do for you which you're doing manually before and then I'll show you how you can actually install that Chrome extension and use that extension to save a lot of your time. Okay, so on the Amazon website, let's just search for any product like rubber made food storage containers, right? So after searching that keyword on Amazon, you can see that Amazon is showing me some results for this keyword and I can see some food storage containers from the brand Rubbermaid, right? So if I search for that keyword and if I scroll down, I will be able to find many of the listing, right? So basically if I'm a buyer and I want to purchase that product and I go on Amazon and search for that product, then before purchasing from any of the listing, I will have to make my purchase decision and that decision will be based on the main image, the title, the price and the rating of that listing right so for example if we take the example of these two listings and if i zoom in so from there i can see that this first seller is selling for 31.98 dollar and the second seller is selling for 24.98 dollar and the rating for the first seller is 4.7 and the second seller is 4.8 however the monthly sales of the first seller is more than 1000 and the monthly sales for the second seller is only 100 right so if i want to sell the same product so basically i want to learn more about that product like how many sales this seller is selling and how many sellers are basically Basically sell on this listing and is this listing is sold by Amazon or not. So if I want to do the wholesale on this product, dropshipping on this product or even private label then I must need to know this data before making my decision to sell that product. Right? So if I want to learn about that data, what I have to actually do is I need to open that listing into the new page and from that page I need to scroll down and check out the price and check out how many sellers are selling on that listing and what are the monthly sales of that listing. So for example, if I go on that listing, so from the right side, I can see that this product is available to sell for $31.99. And if I go further down, I can see that new and used 11 from others. So this means that there are more than 11 sellers selling on this listing. So if I just click on that button and scroll down, so here I will be able to see the name of all of those seller, all of those 11 seller who are actually selling on this listing. So you can see that the first seller is Amazon Warehouse, like Amazon itself selling on this listing. And if I go down, I can see some other seller, right? So you can see that if I scroll down, I can see all of those seller who are basically selling on this listing. So basically if there are 11 sellers selling on this listing and this listing is actually getting getting more than 1000 sales per month so if i just open the calculator and divide 1000 with 11 and divide 1000 with 11 so that means per month one seller is getting 90 plus sales so if i want to sell on this listing i will be the 12th seller so if i just divide 1000 divided by 12 so there are high chances for me to get 83 sales per month if i want to sell on this listing right so this is the thing which i want to analyze for every listing 
And to analyze this, I need to go on Amazon, search for that keyword and open all of those listings one by one to check out how many sales they are getting, how many sellers are they having and if Amazon is selling on that listing or not, right? So instead of doing this work one by one on each listing and giving my time every time 5 to 10 minutes on each listing, I need to go on Google and type DS Quick View. Basically, this is a free Chrome extension that can actually help you to do this work a lot more easier and a lot more faster, right? So after going on Google, after typing on DS Quick View extension, I will be able to see this first link and this link is basically for the Chrome Web Store. So if I click on this link, So I will land on this page and this page says DS Amazon Quick View and more than 500,000 like more than half a million users are using this Chrome extension, right? So if I scroll down, I can see what this Chrome extension basically do for me. And if you want, you can just read that description. But to make this video quick and shorter, you can just install this Chrome extension from the right button install now. But as you can see here, I have already installed this extension. That's why I'm seeing the button remove from Chrome. Right? So after installing that Chrome extension, after logging in with your Google ID, if you go on Amazon and type for any keyword and search, so you will notice that on each of the listing, you will be able to see this extra tab. You can see that this is the extra tab, which you will be able to see after downloading that Chrome extension. And basically that tab will tell you four things. Number one, what is the BSR of this listing and what is the main category? Like for this listing, the BSR is 4,491 into the category kitchen and dining. And the second thing it will tell you is like if this product is sold by Amazon or not. And in this case, yes, it is sold by Amazon. And the third thing, like how many sellers are actually selling on this listing. So basically there are more than five LPA seller selling on that listing. And the last thing this Chrome extension will tell you is the ASIN of that listing. So basically this is the data, like this is the data which you will be able to check after opening the listing of your competitor. Like if I open that listing into a new tab, then if I want to find out the number of seller, find out the ASIN, find out if Amazon is selling or not and find out the BSR. So I need to go on that listing and I need to scroll down. And to find out the BSR, I need to go on the info page and from there I will be able to find the BSR. You can see that the BSR is this into the kitchen and dining category and this is basically the ASIN. And if I want to find out the sales or the competitor or the seller who are selling, so I need to go there and there I can see all of those sellers. Right? So if I download this Chrome extension, so without opening all of the listing one by one, I will be able to check out this data on my front page. You can see that whenever you go on Amazon and type for your main keyword, so you will be able to see this box under each and every listing. And from there, you can just check out what is the BSR, what is the ASIN, how many sellers are selling and if Amazon is selling or not. So you can see that if we compare these four listings, so the listing number one, number two and number three is sold by Amazon, but listing number four is not sold by Amazon. And there are three plus seller on the listing number one, no seller on two, no seller on three and more than 10 seller present on listing number four, right? And the BSR is 933 in kitchen and dining, 711, 815 and 3949. Right? So basically this Chrome extension will make your work a lot more easier and instead of opening all of the listing one by one, you can see this data on your front page without opening all of the listing and that can actually save a lot of your time when you are doing the product research or when you are doing the competitor research. So by doing that, you will be able to make your decision even more faster and even more accurate. And just for example, if I just type this keyword and if I just analyze these four seller, so without thinking a lot, without opening these listings one by one, I can just make my decision quickly with the fourth seller because the fourth seller is actually having a good VSR, good sales, lower selling price, no Amazon selling and 10 FBA seller already present. So this is a very good sign. Like if this listing is actually having more than 1000 sales per month and 10 sellers are present, so that means every seller is actually getting 100 sales or more than 100 sales per month. So if there are more FBA sellers present on any listing and there is no Amazon present, so there are higher chances for you to get the sales if you start selling on this listing. So if you open that listing and try to source that product, get the approval, so you will be start selling on that listing as a retail arbitrage and you will be able to make a quick money even more easier and even more faster. Right? So I hope you really like this Chrome extension and right after watching this video, you will go on Google and install this Chrome extension real quick and take a lot of advantage from it by saving a lot of your time and earning more and more money from Amazon. So that's it for today guys. I hope you really enjoyed the video and learned something great from it. So if you find my content really informative and helpful for you, then make sure to like the video and subscribe the channel as well. So you can watch more and more videos like this in future. Let's meet in the next video. Till then, take care. Bye.